from Minnesota's most watched station. This is WCCO 4 News, live at the Minnesota State Fair. Hi, I'm Ashley. Thanks for joining WCCO from the fair. We begin with breaking news from the dairy building where Princess K of the Milky Way's butter sculpture has melted. We're told emergency butter and sculptures are on the way. Our reporter is on the scene where people are actually dipping their corn on the cob in the melting butter. Let's go there now. Yes, I'm yes, I'm Victoria from the from just outside the dairy building and I can tell you complete chaos over here. People are rushing from all over just get one bit of good news from all of the Princess K is very upset that happened and today we are here and she talked uh, and this Thanks, I'm Christy, and I just returned from talking with Princess Kay. She didn't want to go on camera, but she told me that while she understands it's no one's fault, she's still pretty heartbroken. She had been dreaming for years about having her face carved in butter. Now she is hopeful that dream can still happen, as sculptors told her they believe they can fix the problem quickly and get back to carving. Now let's send it to our investigative reporter who's been looking into what really caused the butter to melt. Thank you, I'm Matt. Sources tell me the warm temperatures out here at the fair were a big factor, but it really comes down to an unplugged air conditioner. State Fair Security says they have proof that Bonnie and Clyde, two blue ribbon winning cows, broke out their barn and went on a crime spree that including raiding corn rows, pulling the plug on the butter head, cooler and riding down the giant slide twice. Bonnie and Clyde were caught trying to break out a couple of pigs from the swine bar. All the animals are now safely back in their pens. Thanks. We're told the new butter and sculptures will be here in just about 10 minutes to help clean up the mess. Look for more reports as we continue to follow this breaking story right here on WCCO News at the State Fair. This has been a WCCO4 News update from the Minnesota State Fair. Thanks for watching.